Say Brakate Yahoa, Brakate O'Shea, Brakate Yahoa, Brakate O'Shea, Brakate Yahoa, Brakate O'Shea. First and foremost, I want to give our praises and honor and glory to Yahweh, Bashem Yahweh, Bashem Rakakodash, double honors to the apostles and elders who were a great stone and a blessed sanitation to the Akims and the four kind of to push in the gospel in sincerity and truth. Shalom. All right, just want to do our uh, commentary on this article, right? They said the, uh, it's a better train company of Trinidad to Tobago limited right so you know they about to lay off about approximate 2600 permanent they're about to cut approximately two 2600 permanent job right they said will be affected right so you know the scripture also say the grinding shall cease the grinding shall become low right so you know the most i the most i can make are you proud niggas uncomfortable the ones who they want to take heed and repent and turn back unto him, he's gonna make y'all uncomfortable, right? In these upcoming destruction, you know, the economy gonna collapse, the dollar gonna die, they gonna have famine, race war, martial law, war war tree. You know, these is the evil days. You understand? And a lot of you proud niggas and bitches gonna be affected because when you refuse to turn back to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh speaking to you so can Negroes, Latinos and Native American Indian in the island of Trinidad to be super proud you know so let me just go into this um, article it's a petrochin exit oil refining business to reinvent itself now able he said now able to to refinance debt debt and become self-sustainable right he said a petrochin board of direct meet on tuesday august 28 2018 with its employee and representative union and the company and the company's management to announce plan to end petrotrin oil refining operation at point of pier and to resign entirely its exp exploration and production business the restructuring said the restructuring exercise is is geared to curtail own oil company and get it on a path sustainable is a um, profit profit profitability approximately 2600 permit um, permanent job will be affected he said so like it will re redesign explore exploration and production business will have approximately 800 worker and all 1700 job in refining will be terminated right so 700 job you know going to be um terminated right it's a petrochin petrochin is um committed to cautioning the effect of any fallout occur from planning change from planning change he said that announce, the announcement follow months of careful review and analysis by the by the company by the company board of director which was appointed last september to identify the problem at petrotrin and take the step necessary to make make the company self-sustainable and profitable petrotrin has lost a total of about eight billion tt dollar in the last five years it's 12 billion tt um tt 12 billion tt in debts and owes the government of trinidad and tobago more than three billion in taxes and royalty he said a company current um currently require a cash injection of 25 billion tt dollars to, to stay alive to refresh its infrastructure and to repay its debt and even with that if left as is it is a um, project to continue losing about two billion a year and this is tt dollar two billion a year he said chairman wilfred s um, s pin said 
with the termination of the refining op uh, operation and, re and um, resigning the expo ex exploration and production, Petrochin will now be able to independently finance fi uh, finance all of its debt and become sustainable business. Petrochin is no longer producing enough oil to operate the point of pier refinery efficiently. We are producing approximately 40,000 barrels of oil a day and the refinery op operate at, at a capacity of 140,000 barrels a day. So we have to go to the market to buy about 100,000 barrels of oil to make up the shortfall. This results this results in a, in a net loss in foreign exchange right he said the refine the refining of oil will be phased out and the company will import the refined product gasoline diesel aviation fuel etc that the company need approximately 25000 barrel of oil equivalent a day all of all of the company oil will be exported right so hey a lot of you proud niggas they gonna go feel it right you understand because hey the most i about to bring the hammer down in this island you know because a lot of you proud a lot of you niggas wicked you know and y'all refuse to hearken unto the voice of yahweh bashem yahweh shai you know y'all is passing y'all is scoffing against the men out, out on the highways and byways a lot of y'all got a lot of things to say on, on YouTube about, you know, about the man, the Lord, you know. And this is not only Trinidad, this is worldwide. Because you Israelites scatter, you know, among these heathen <coughs> in, all, in, all, in all four corners of the earth. You understand? And this is Jacob Trouble. You understand? A lot of you, a lot of you Israelites here, you know, laughing at the Venezuelan. You know, got a lot of, a lot, I'm, I'm making a lot of mock, mockery at them. A lot of you, a lot, a, a lot of you heathens. And Israelites, y'all oppressing them when they come on this side, you know, paying them, paying, pay, um, exploiting them. You understand? So the same thing happened in Venezuela, it's gonna happen over here too. You know, <coughs> the TT dollar gonna, they gonna, they gonna, they gonna reach the inflation. You know, the dollar gonna collapse. You know, with the tariff war we're going now with America and China, you know, and, and Russia, Iran, Turkey, in this place, you know, things gonna get real expensive. You understand? And World War Three, these people must stop doing trading. They're gonna keep back the goods, right? You understand? He said, um, as Spin said, our goal is for Petrochrin to be um, internationally co uh, competitive and sustainable, um, profitable leader in the local energy sector, and an employer of choice. That is, that is. That is a source of national pride. Yeah, the most I can destroy all the pride. You understand? He said that the period of um, trans transition will commence commence on the 1st of October 2018. Right? He said the board of direct is is taking all re all re um, request step to facilitate is a smooth and e efficient period of transition with with safety and the security of the country fuel supply being its two um priorities right so hey you know yao bashem yao shai gonna bring bring evil in this island you know because like i say you niggas pro you know a lot of a lot of jobs gonna be cut you know a lot of you gonna be in distress right the most i gonna make y'all uncomfortable right this is um <clears throat> Yeah, this is the time that we're in. Uh, the time of sorrow, time of great evil, death and destruction. Right? This is Ecclesiastes, Ecclesiastes chapter 12, verse 1. He said, Remember now thy creator in the days of thy youth. Remember the creator in the days of thy youth. Right? While the evil day come not. What was the evil day? The economy, the economy collapsed, the dollar died. You know, fun, race war. Martial law, then got foreign troop and train at the bigger putting you 
put you Israelite in free camp and putting the chip in you. World War Three. These are the evil day. And you Israelite to take the microchip gonna die. Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai gonna kill y'all. Revelation 14, 8, 9, and 10 going down there. I'm tell you who take the chip gonna be destroyed. Right? He said, Remember now thy creator in the day of thy youth, while the evil day come not, nor the year draw near, when thou shalt say, I have no pleasure in them. And the evil day you are not gonna have no pleasure in it because it's is it's, it's, it's a holy for sorrow. Death and destruction, mourning. You understand? They can take away. So you're not gonna, you're not gonna have no pleasure in them evil day. You can can't be able to go by KFC and buy a, a two piece. I go down the road and buy a beer. It's, it's death and destruction. It's riot. It's race war. These are those are the evil day, right? It's a verse two. While the sun, or the light, or the moon, or the star be darkening nor the cloud return after the rain and these are symbolic for wisdom knowledge and understanding and what the father can do the most i can what the most i can withdraw is withdraw wisdom knowledge and understanding from from the earth they're going to be the family of the world that's why he said the scriptures in isaiah 32 say wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of your time so the most i can draw away is wisdom from the from the earth you understand it's going to be a family of the world and you niggas going to be destroyed because you nigga put your you nigga put your trust in man you put your trust in a system right for a street in the day when the keeper of the house shall tremble these leaders the, the keeper of the house is where the, the, the house is where the system the system will be destroyed right he said and the strong men and the strong men shall bow down themselves starting with the military the police you tough niggas you proud niggas and bitches you are gonna tremble right he said um and the grinding seas because there are few the grinding is employment the grinding seas so you see petrochin refining refining a company closing down close close down you understand they're gonna close down right you understand so hey the grinding the grinding the grinding and seas because they are few and those that look out of the window be darkening he said and the door and the door shall be shut in the street when the song of the grinding is low, employment is low. You understand? So are you proud niggas out there? You know, who got a little, a little, uh, uh, have a, a good job and you're being proud and you're not, you're not even thinking about your how about Hashem, you shy because he gave you that, you know. Yeah, the most I can take it back from you. Right? And you are going to be destroyed. Right? He said, and the door shall be shut in the street when the song of the grinding is low and and shall rise up at the voice of the bird and all the dot of music shall be brought low yeah you are going to be brought low ah your pride you know you are going to be brought low because you refuse knowledge you reject knowledge you don't want to serve you so you have been you have put your trust in the system so you are going to be coarse when when the most high when the most high cut his star for the bread right and this will be seen right a lot of people are going to be going to lose a job you know, the economy can collapse. You know, it's gonna be total chaos, eh? right? So take heed, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. You take heed, repent, and turn back to your house, Hashem Yahushai, for the evil day draw near, right? And we in Salak, and we in the time, we in the evil day. Hey, so repent, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. They hear in Trinidad, repent, turn back to your house, Hashem Yahushai. And with that, we listen to the fire. I want to give our praises and honor and glory to your house, Hashem Yahushai. Bashem Rakakodash, double honors to the apostles and elders who rule well a great millstone, and a blessed sanitation to the Akyams in the four county, you are to push in the gospel in sincerity. Church shall one.